Konnichiwa YouTubers, this is Rest Talk straight from Japan and today we're going to do a video review of Mass Rider Hibiki Kurenai. And this is actually from the Mass Rider Hibiki series back released back in 2005. Uh, this is the uh, second form and basically he's a demon, he's an oni. Uh, that's what a demon is in Japanese. So I kind of like that. I kind of dig the fact that he's, I don't know, uh, anti-hero, whatever you want to call him. So let's go ahead and quickly quick, take a quick look at the box. There's a little great detail. Uh, there's a little half screen to show you. There's Hibiki, Kamen Raida Hibiki Kurenai. Uh, that's what it says back here too. <laughs> and there's a little detail on the side over here, grasping his little cudgels. Uh, this is a tokusatsu, so that's a profile. This is live action, as you can see, that's what tokusatsu is. And there's that FX Friends pose. <laughs> that's what I'm trying to emulate right there. So let's go ahead, take a look at the figure. This is about five and a half inches, so a little shorter than a six inch figure. Uh, real nice little crimson red detail, and I'm going to show you. I especially like the details, the Oni, because he's a Oni. Uh, he has the, the horns right here, a little mask or whatever the heck, the detail face on that. Um, red, this is, the, the helmet actually comes off, and I'll show you the tiny little head that comes with it. I started out, because there's extra pieces over here, as you can see, he's got the little disc animals and whatever. I like the detail on the common Rider belt and the cod piece, and um, yeah, the little cudgels, whatever they do. So good detailing. I'm going to go ahead and show you the articulation, but first I forgot to show you that there is one extra piece, which I have no idea what's it for. Uh, it comes with it, and it is kind of similar to that little piece that he has on the side there. Uh, really similar, I mean, there we go. So let's go ahead and show you the articulation. Uh, neck is on a ball joint. Oh, his head popped off. Kind of a preview, but I'll show you his tiny little head later. Our, our shoulder is on a ball joint. Couldn't go in and out. And get rid of the cudgels here. I like the fact that, it, you can, as you can see, the, arm, or the fingers are splayed out so they can actually grab the cudgels. And bicep swivel. Only a single joint on the elbow. Wrist has uh, some rotation doesn't have an app crunch and the waist only swivels so far uh, I guess it's a ball jointed on the hip it kinda has a thigh swivel right there double jointed knee has a ball joint on the ankle which allows it to get pretty good posability as you can see I think uh, that's hard plastic I thought it was eye cast at first so as you can see it definitely doesn't have all these extra parts uh, I, I kinda like it cause these things like the chest the armor comes off the cudgel comes off this comes off that would come off and the belt does I don't know if the belt comes off but I do know that the armor does snap off in the back here but I would just want to show you real quick and as you can see one of the pieces fell off already uh, I want to show you this tiny little head All right, <laughs> look at that See, as you, oh yeah, there, as you can see, that popped off, so I know that these uh, parts actually do pop off, and that just trips me out, the tiny little head, just to show you. There we go. <laughs> I, I don't know why it trips me out so much, but yeah, it's, it's a tiny little head. Let me put, let me put his max back on before I start goofing here. Something like that. All right, so he's much better over here. All right, let's get his pose of posing over here. And as a size comparison, I got Megatron right here. This is the deluxe class. So, oh, there we go. Got it. So he is about five, five and a half inch scale. Uh, I don't know where my she spawn is, and that's quite all right. And as you can see, the pieces do fall off. So I lost quite a few pieces already. And that's all right. Oh, well, let me go ahead and rate them. I do like them. I love the crimson red. I like the detailing. So let's give them a 7.5 out of 10. All right, YouTubers, that's all I got, and I'll catch you all next time.